The rockets are being fueled. The blueprints are in motion. And whether you choose to be a spectator or a creator, that's on you. But make no mistake, the future is being printed one layer at a time, one decision at a time. And that first layer, it starts with you. Let me tell you something I've learned after working with millions of people across the globe. The one thing that separates success from struggle, wealth from poverty, leadership from mediocrity, is not just knowledge, it's speed. Speed is the new power. In a world that's moving faster than ever before, it's not the big that beat the small anymore, it's the fast that beat the slow. We used to live in an economy of scale, now we live in an economy of agility. And if you're not moving, adapting, creating, you're getting left behind, period. Now think about this in terms of building. In the traditional world, if you wanted to build a house, it took months. If you were lucky, you needed materials, labor, permits, delays, you know the deal. But what if I told you in the world we're stepping into? A house can be printed in 24 hours, a neighborhood in a week. And we're not talking about some tiny cardboard box here. We're talking about full-sized, modern, structurally sound buildings. That's what 3D printing is doing to construction, and that same mindset of speed, automation, and precision is what will define our future on the moon. Because let me be real with you, when we go to the moon, we don't have the luxury of taking months to build. We don't get weather delays. We don't call in a plumber. We need to land. We need to print. We need to survive. Speed isn't a nice to have. It's life or death. That's why NASA, the European Space Agency, and innovators like Icon and Big Architects are developing systems that can deploy instantly, build autonomously, and adapt in real time. Imagine this, a robotic printer lands on the moon, 